Hi everyone, today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm doing a showcase of my MAC lipsticks. Now this may be helpful for you if you love the MAC lipstick formulation or perhaps if you have back to MAC empties and would like some inspiration. I suspect that some of the nuances in colour may not translate to video, so I'm going to be posting lots of swatches and pictures in a blog post that will be listed in the description box below. Skin tone wise, I'm about an NC25 and everything that I'm wearing on my face and on my nails will be listed in the description box also. Let's start with naturals and nudes. Hug Me, a fleshy muted pink. I reach for this shade a lot and it's a great nude shade for those who have pigmented lips. Freckle Tone, a light beigey peach with a creamy consistency. Half and Half, a pinky brown in the tube but a more natural shade on the lips. This reminds me of Hug Me but it is a little bit browner. Syrup, a sheer cloudy pink, very easy to wear. Sea Sheer, a sheer and muted coral, a good natural lipstick for those who have warmer complexions. Kinda Sexy, a neutral pink, lovely shade but nude mattes don't really do me any favours. Pinks, Love Forever, a cool tone fuchsia. Show Orchid. Vibrant fuchsia with a purple sheen. Insanely It, a watermelon pink with magenta shimmer. Impassioned, a bright warm pink. This has no shimmer. It reminds me of Insanely It, but it's a little bit more opaque. Purples, Violetta, a pinkened violet shade with purple iridescence. Corals and oranges. Morange, a vibrant orange with a cream finish and no shimmer. Korean candy, an orangey red with a glossy finish. Vegas Vault, a creamy orange coral that applies opaque. Coral Bliss, a muted pink coral lipstick. This finish has a small amount of frost, but it's tolerable. Reds, So Shored, a vibrant red lipstick with prominent orange undertones. Dubonnet, a deep red with brown tinge. No shimmer, but a little sheen. Cockney, a sheer but buildable orange red. This contains very subtle red shimmer. Vamps. Cyber for the brave of us. A deep and red and purple. This probably would be more wearable if worn as a stain. Good to be bad. A reddened burgundy with a semi gloss finish. Not as pigmented as Cyber. Rebel. A deep fuchsia berry. Super popular as it's wearable while retaining that vampy feel. Dark side. A deep cool toned burgundy. This one is super super opaque. <sighs> that was long. If you made it to the end then give us a thumbs up and just reiterating that Swatches and extra information will be posted on my blog and I'll leave that link in the description box below. I hope you all found this helpful and have a wonderful week. I shall see you next time.